Hello there, this is not me, this is my cousin. There I am. Me, this is more um, 2v2 with my cousin. We're going to be rushing them. We, we had this big thing where we played like 12 games in a row and rushing them a bunch with cannons and bunkers and everything. It was just a great time, great time. <coughs> So here's my little, <coughs> excuse me, phlegm, throat, annoying. My little probe out here. Throw up my first pylon. That's not my pylon. That's the enemy's first pylon, right um, next to mine. And here it was just kind of like, oh crap! Haha! <laughs> my guy started attacking his slightly faster. His SCV came up. I thought I'd be screwed because he was attacking me. Cousin's laughing like, "Ha ha! I got my killed his probe. Throw down, attack a bit. Oh wait, go down the forge. He's building his first supply depot. Um, so he canceled his supply depot. He's gonna go build it again. I put down my forge and then ran away because this guy was trying to kill me. Okay, he can come back and kill the pylon. That's fine by me." Go ahead, attack the pylon. I'll throw up another one. Powering the forge. So if this one does go down, I still have a powered forge. I don't even think I need the powered forge. I think I just need the pylon. Or the forge to be built somewhere. But also I have the overlap here. Forge going up. Cousin sending his drone carrying minerals down here to fight for me. Okay. Getting my guy up. Increase the speed a bit. Sorry, just going up faster. He th says he thinks we win because they have no co economy because they've pulled off three probes to fight and this guy started building a supply depot, another one. He's getting his bunkers, we don't know that. But here comes his zerglings because my cousin did, of course, eight um, built at eight supply, build a spawning pool. He did the eight pool rush and the eight pool rush is very effective. They're the enemy lost his um, one pylon that was out here. He was building another one. But my cousin was has those zerglings. Very useful. I think he came in here and pecked away at a couple, a bit more of his suppl um, supply. Getting down cannons for a decent block off. They're a little bit behind. I'm doing fine with my 14 guys gathering minerals and two gathering gas as I'm working on my first gateway. This is my standard Dark Templar switch. Get the cannons up. Have the don't need as many cannons because my cousin has a bunch of zerglings, but I'm still throwing them up because paranoid of a two-player push. Two-player can get a decent enough army to push out. Oh, look at that! Another zealot scouting. Guilt trying to go. Four gate. Haha. <laughs> yeah, building four gate instead of just pumping out zealots a lot. Yeah, he is getting out the zealots. Saying, we don't need luck, we have cheese. You don't need luck when your strategy um, has no viable counter yet because no one would build a counter to something that no one ever does. Except for, you know, me and my cousin. We do this. There's unpowered. So he can now run against this guy. Oh, look at that. He has a bunker. Okay. Just run around the bunker. Got Waff one shot to the army of Syracuse running in. And he can move in and wreak havoc. Doesn't quite get it on fire. But, yeah. Mass SCVs. Against completely unupgraded zerglings, just a zergling rush. He quits. All I did was build the cannons and um, have my dark shrine on the way while my cousin got in with a bunch of zerglings and forced to surrender. But, ah, uh, it's great. Just some silly rushes. I have two more of these videos to do.
Hey, it's recording. I didn't realize it was recording. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah. This is again 2v2. Me and my cousin. We are rushing. We are both playing random. Um, this time, ironically, the opponents were also playing random. Murderface and Dom were playing random. So, my cousin asked, hey, should we just bunker rush? This is right after the previous, or a tower rush. Not sure if it was the game I just showed or not. There may have been a game or two in between. But we were doing the same thing the entire time with Protoss. So he's like, hey, we should do this with Terran too. Sure, why not? Yeah, send out my SCV to go get that um, supply depot up. Gonna need it. Cousin goes off to do a basic wall off at first, I think. I don't know. He sends out his SCP to get his bunker up and starts his supply depot here. I just went out and started my supply depot right off the bat out here. Throwing up everything out there, because... I don't know why. He's starting his supply depot here. This is a pretty decent. Me and my cousin have done this, where... You get supply depots, and then your bunkers, and some um, defensive, and some uh, your barracks, and then some bunkers, and you can wall off this gap pretty easily. So you can get a decent wall off, guard that, um, get a second expansion pretty quickly. So there goes down our barracks. Set my rally point down here. This is blind. Um, I don't even know that that's there yet, but FTP so just. Ready just happened to be doing that with them there. These guys, he, submurder face, get a supply depot and barracks in his base. Getting some gas, throwing down another barracks down here. Us getting our barracks is, them getting their barracks is, already have one up here. What does he do with this one? I think he left it, I don't remember it being up there, but whatever. So immediately, two marines and this guy come down here. I was going to go in and build a bunker inside their base, but hey, there's a barracks there. Okay, I'll put a bunker right here. Cousin's laughing. Not finds it funny. Ha <laughs> ha. There's the barracks lifting down. So he puts down his bunker right there. And I put down another one here. And our marines, first marine pops. They had a marine. I'm not actually sure who got their marine first. But we have our marines and... We have our bunkers coming on their line of barracks. They are putting a lot of money into barracks. We're putting money into bunkers and marines. Cousin has a second barracks. Uh, I don't. Don't really need it. So we have our bunkers up with some marines in them. Pecking away at these guys'. Is, this one. Focus firing. Oh no, he's coming down to kill my cousin's SUV. Picked him off, gonna pick off an easy bunker, bunker. But I get my guy in my bunker and back at him, back away at him. Lifting off, moving back a bit so that they can mass marine back here. Well, we just keep pushing forward. I send down an SCV, cause hey, their bunkers aren't here anymore. Oh, there's a bunker there, I'm scared. Come over here, don't realize that that bunker is empty. Throw down another bunker. Decent um, SCV. Only at 20 supply with two supply depots, so. Just building them as fast as one bunker can put it out. Don't need anything else other than that because we've completely screwed up their economy. No, I do need my cousin with his guys down here. I do have my second barracks down here. Have this bunker just finished, got a guy in there with almost no health. Move up, four more guys more guys to get this to a full bunker. Get up here to start building another one. Oh my, no, his bunker's down with the reactor. Have my two SCVs just attacking. These guys were shooting at this for no reason. Murderface has left the game. Dom has left the game. Afraid of a little marine rush because Getting ghost academies and factories, spending all this mo extra money on this stuff. I don't even know why. All we had to do was get out a bunch of marines. Quick marine rush. I don't know. I find this to be slightly less fun than the um, photon cannons. But the getting the line of bunkers on their line of barracks was just funny. Um, 
and then pushing in. Yeah, found that funny. Have one more video to show you.